Now to our other big story today. The Coast Guard is still searching for a missing person after a deadly boating accident. It all started yesterday when crews were notified about an overturned boat between Nags Head and Rodanthe. They found former Wicked Tuna boat captain Charlie Griffin and a dog both dead during yesterday's search. 10 on your sides, Amy Avery joins us with more now on the search and what people in the fishing community are saying. Amy? Well, Stephanie and Regina, we're learning that Griffin, his dog, and another man named Chad, who was on the boat, were all seen at Rudy Inlet on Sunday morning. One man says he helped get them in contact with a mechanic to help get the boat started. Pat Foster says a friend of his called and told him that Charlie and Chad needed help getting the boat running on Sunday morning. Foster says the boat had been at the fishing center fuel station for a few weeks now. He says the boat wasn't theirs, but they were trying to get it back to Wanchi's that day. Later that morning, Foster says he went out with a mechanic and they helped get that boat up and running. They got the boat, one motor running, another one was blown up and the weather was really pretty. Um, and after about an hour, they were good to go. Boat went in and out of gear, and, uh, and we talked for a little bit between then, the time they left, and they left out of here, and everything was good. And uh, I called them about 4:30 and see how they were doing, and everything was still good. And I said, "Okay, it looks like you're on the, the last leg of the trip." So, you know, I hadn't heard from them since then, and then I found out the next morning what happened. Now, Foster says this is a big loss for the fishing community. Later tonight, we spoke with another local fisherman who knew Griffin, who voiced concern about the dangers for boaters traveling in and out of Oregon Inlet. That part of the story coming up at 6. Amy Avery, 10 on your side.